Hey, hey, what is up? Good morning. Uh, good afternoon if you're on the East Coast. Uh, looks like my video uh, looks like it's a little grainy. So hopefully, I'm not sure if that's my lighting. It's a different setup than, than when I go live in the morning. I am in the room, in my card room, uh, just because I cleaned up. It's not as messy. And I was able to uh, to move in my my essentially my breaking table. It's basically just a card table. So I ordered 24 blaster boxes from uh, Walmart.com. I believe they're sold out, um, but uh, they were uh, they were live on uh, Tuesday night. Uh, it's a quick ship. Shipped out yesterday afternoon. Got them this morning. Uh, just like literally. Uh, a couple minutes ago, wake and break sports cards. Can you hear me? Can you see me? Um, let's see. I, the video is super grainy, so I don't know what's going on with my, with my video. Um, I'm also getting some, I wonder if that's okay. There's wake and break. So I'm going to try to try to avoid hitting that wire. Let's, let's see here. So we've got uh, 2022 Bowman. Just saw your hand. It's working. All good. Audio. Is the audio working? Uh, let's see. All good. Audio. I just saw your hand. It's working. Ben, what's up? Wake and break. Good morning to you. Straight execution. Looks okay. Audio is fine. Awesome. Road trip to SoCal. Hit some card shops and shows. Awesome. So let's break. Uh, Walmart Blasters. Uh, they did raise the price. To thirty-two dollars. I'm use some scissors here. Uh, also, this table, my the table I'm using is kind of sucks. Uh, it's so I apologize for the shakiness. I should have brought a different table in, um, because that's going to be really annoying. I wonder. Let's let's do something here. I apologize for the delay in ripping, but I want to give you some decent video quality move some of these around i'm gonna build build a makeshift <laughs> makeshift camera on a steadier surface bear with me here i don't know what cards those are but okay let's move over here there we go there we go now let's see let's move the table there you see, we've got some blasters. I don't know how many I'm going to break. We'll see. But I bought 24 blasters. And uh, I'm definitely saving a, a, a few for tomorrow night. My buddy Herman's going to be in town. Andrew says mine are out for delivery. Hurry up FedEx, right? Uh, fortunately, our FedEx UPS here uh, is a little slower. Let's see. I'm Bear with me here. I'm going to move this camera angle. There we go. Get a tighter, get a tighter shot. Okay. So first pack, 2022 Bowman. Yeah, uh, 32 bucks for a blaster box. We've got Ha Song Kim. I like these. Vlad Jr. By the way, if you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. Hit the like button. If you like it or not, <laughs> Yadi Molina. So these are the base cards. Once I get going, uh, I'll kind of flip through these a little faster. Uh, but here we go. Here's the Chrome. We've got Emerson Hancock, top 100 prospects. He's number 14, Seattle Mariners. I put the Chrome off on the side because, uh, let's see. Oh, this is a first paper. The Dodgers, Eddie Lenard. Elijah Tatis must be, uh, is that Fernando Tatis? His little brother, maybe? Uh, younger brother of Fernando Tatis Jr. So there it is. An early look at Elijah Tatis, younger brother of Fernando in the White Sox organization. Uh, first Bowman, Simon Muziati. He has had, I believe he was in like Bowman Platinum. Uh, but he's he's had some cards here. And we got a couple first chromes, a pitcher. And we've got uh, Andre Lara, first Chrome, and Everson Artiaga. I think uh, Michael Rathburn was talking about this guy, Artiaga of the uh, of the Giants. So 
That's pack number one. I love these cards, but I love Bowman. I'm a Bowman fan. I will rip Bowman like 32 bucks. Yeah, 32 bucks is uh, is a much higher price point than than what it previously has been. I believe it was $25 last year. Of course, uh, usually $20. So $32 per blaster box. But I still think it's worth it. Hey, there's a look at the Wander Franco rookie card. Let's come on, focus camera. Wander Franco rookie. Wander Franco rookie. We got Jonathan India base, base paper. Yeah, he was a rookie last year. Bryce Harper. There's uh, there is Fernando Tatis Jr. Him and his little brother in the set. Here we've got a first Bowman of Misael Gonzalez. They're putting a lot of the uh, international signees, the the young kids. So uh, Gonzalez was born in 2001. Uh, so that makes him, he's 20, his birthday's next month. So he's, he's going to be 21. So he's a little older, older than some of these other guys. Um, we've got, uh, Junior Sanchez, first Bowman of, uh, the Marlins. He was born in December of 02. So he's 19. Uh, Ronnie Mauricio, the New York Mets. And, uh, here we've got a couple Chromes. We've got Rasmar Quintana. Chrome of Rosmar Cantana, Washington Nationals. Love the look of these cards. Gives me 2019 Bowman vibes. Yeah, it does. It does. Without the uh, without like the gray streaks that, that they kind of had in 2019. Uh, Cooper Kinney, Chrome prospect. All right. What do we have in here? Felt like this pack was a little thicker, but it was just, it was not. George Springer, Carlos Cray. I'm going to start going through these. These paper vets a little a little faster. There's a rookie card of Matt Veerling. Another rookie card, Shane Baz. Is it Baz or Baz? I'm not sure. Jackson Kowar. Here we've got a High Five Futures. This is a cool insert. I love that insert. High Five Futures. Blaze Jordan. Uh, another first Bowman. Rodolfo uh, Nolasco. Prospect of uh, Emmanuel Rodriguez. Maximo Acosta, first chrome, Jose Rodriguez, another first chrome of a White Sox, Nor Norge, I don't know if it's Norge or Norge, uh, Vera, and he was born in uh, 2000, June 1st of 2000. All right, so we've got, what, three more packs? So, uh, by the way, it's 2022 Bowman Blaster Boxes. They were $32 at Walmart.com. 72 cards per box. You get uh, six packs per box and 12 cards per pack, which is uh, the same uh, breakdown as is, is, uh, 2021. Had uh, 72 cards per blaster box. And uh, as I mentioned earlier, the price point has gone up $32, which is likely what you'll see in stores. So since retail is, is live, uh, I've seen a couple photos of, of stocked shelves of these. 2022 Bowman blasters. Um, I would expect them to be stocked at most stores tomorrow uh, when, when stores, Walmarts, and Targets are stocked on Fridays. Here's another insert Bowman in 3D, Shane Baz. That's a pretty cool insert. I'm always a sucker for, for Bowman on release. Uh, just seeing the new design, seeing the new insert sets. There's a top 100 prospect, uh, Marco Luciano. We've got Matt Frazier, first Bowman, Alexander Vargas, the uh, New York Yankees. Nice White Sox checklist for first Bowmans. Another first Bowman out of the White Sox, Benjamin Bailey. And I'm not sure if that's uh, pronouncing that right, Benjamin. Jackson Churio, and it looks like I've got my first Cub coming up. So here's a Milwaukee Brewer and uh, the first 2022 Bowman Cub. Yo, Hendrick Penango was able to catch him at uh, spring training uh, last month. Got his autograph on a couple of his first Bowman cards from like, two years ago, last year or two years ago. Yo, Hendrick Penango goes into the Cubs pile. I haven't pulled any color or refractors. Usually, even in retail, Bowman has some good, uh, some good color and good refractors. It's a good bang for your buck. 
right now, this is probably, I mean, it's, it's at release. Hobby is not released until next week. So this is a, a very early look at, uh, at 2022 Bowman. Um, any Valera. I've not pulled a George Valera yet. This is the first box I've opened. Here's Jorge Soler. Here's a rookie of the year favorites, Jaron Duran. Set that they, uh, insert set that they continue doing each year. I kind of like it. Here's a Max Muncy, first Bowman, Oakland Athletics. I can barely see the cards. Is it because of the, is it the, the video looks very grainy? Is it grainy video or is it the not focus? Um, I'm not sure. Got uh, Robert Dominguez. First Bowman. Denzer Guzman. And I wonder if this guy is any relation to Felix. Alejandro P.A. It is grainy, and I'm not sure why it's so grainy, because my video this morning was okay. Uh, maybe it's the US, no, it's the same USB port I, I typically use. I'm not sure why. I'm getting that. It's even when I focus, it's grainy. I wonder. Let's. I've got a tissue here. Let's see if this works. Maybe it does. It's still grainy. I'm not sure what uh, what's going on. That appeared not to help at all. All right, last pack from Blaster number one. Upload speed seems unstable. Okay, that that makes sense because my uh, my internet does suck down here. I am in the I'm in a in the same I'm in the card room where I usually do video, but I bet CTSP is correct. I bet it's my my internet connection because my internet connection typically does suck. Jordan Alvarez, Jaron Duran, rookie. Uh, so maybe I'll do a couple blasters and uh, maybe I'll move rooms. Try to get a better video or I could go live from my phone in the other room. Virtuos, virtu, virtuosic vibrations. Pretty cool insert. Louis Angel Acuna. Now we've got uh, Michael Escado. First Bowman for the Pirates. Move the camera to another spot. I'm kind of uh, I'm kind of stuck with the camera right here because I don't want to put it on the table because the table is unstable. Um, uh, Adele Amador, uh, Michael Triana, first Chrome. I don't think there was a single refractor in uh, in this box. Uh, let's see, Isaac Pacheco, Luis Verdugo, the first first Chrome of the Chicago Cubs. So I got two Cubs in this box: Yo Hendrick Penango and Luis Verdugo, and they're both they're both uh, Chrome cards. For Kelvin De Castro. So let's take a look at uh, the odds. Uh, pack odds. Wow, these this is really sh uh, small print. Let's see. Uh, base card parallels. Sky blue, one in 178 packs. Neon green, one in 223 packs. So right off the bat, uh, we're looking at some long odds in retail. Uh, Chrome prospect parallels. A refractor is one in 115 packs. Holy cow. So let's do the math on that. Uh, one in 115 packs. And there's what, six packs? Holy crap. No wonder we didn't get any refractors, right? That is every 20 blaster boxes, you'll get a refractor. So these odds are really long. Let's see. Super refractor. Super refractor. Uh, one in 468,024. So let's, let's do the math. 468,024. Divided by our six packs, it'll take you seventy-eight thousand four blaster boxes to pull a super fractor at thirty-two bucks a box. That'll cost you two point five million dollars. Uh, 
a super fractor. Yeah, 468,000 for holy crap. So I think they printed a lot of Bowman. So uh, if you haven't got any Bowman, or if you don't find any Bowman this week, I think we'll, we'll you'll be okay. Kind of gives me, <laughs> gives me a little pause of saying it's worth the $32. I don't know if it is with those odds. Holy cow. Uh, oh, the the odds on the box are much are much uh, much easier to read, not on camera, but in person. So here we go. Just make sure I got the super fractor odds correct. Platinum printing plate prospect parallels. Where's super fractor? Doesn't even say on here. Ah, uh, there it is. Ninety three thousand six hundred five. Okay, so that's a little. It's not quite the 400 some thousand. All right, so here we go. Uh, box number two. Box number two, Bowman 2022. Gavin Sheets. Looks like the uh, looks like the camera's a little better for this box. Looks like we've cleared up a little bit. Miggy Cabrera, who just had his 3,000th hit. Cabrian Hayes. Randy Arazarino. And uh, rookie card of Matt Manning. Here's another Hi-Fi future coming up. Carlos... Colmenares, I think he had a first Bowman in, in draft. Um, Blaze Jordan, paper prospect. What's up, Victor? Got uh, Maximo Acosta. First Bowman, Junior Sanchez. I think I pulled him in the last blaster box. Diego Cartaya. And Emmanuel Rodriguez. So that uh, is pack number one out of box number two. Twenty twenty two Bowman. I'm a Bowman freak. I love these cards. Jose Ramirez, if you're uh, joining in for the first time, welcome to the channel. I appreciate it. Subscribe. I do a morning video at seven a.m. every morning. Just talk about what's up in the hobby. Do a lot of uh, chat with uh, with those that are in the chat room, and that's a lot of fun. Seven a.m. Central Time every weekday morning, and then uh, weekend times vary. And then I do some nostalgia breaks. Yesterday, I opened a pack of 1990 Topps Baseball. And uh, recently, I've opened a pack of Howard the Duck cards from 1986. I opened a pack of Charlie's Angels cards from the late 70s. Opened a pack of The Simpsons. So uh, so check that out. I, I try to do nostalgia breaks um, quite often. So not as often as I... I haven't been doing them as often as I should, but check those out on my channel. Subscribe. Really appreciate it. Hit the like button on this video. Victor says it's the best morning show on YouTube. Thank you. I appreciate that. Might be the only one, <laughs> but it's still the best. Jaron Duran, rookie Kyle Muller, Spencer Strider. Ben Heyer says, Blaze Jordan, I am so interested. Uh, in the description uh, of this video, I will be listing all of these singles in my eBay store. Um, so check that out. The link to my eBay store is in the item description. Okay, this is an interesting card. I'm going to just check the numbers on the back. Nope, it's the same code, but I love this photo. I don't know if you saw it. Look at this photo with the cornfield in the background. Come on, camera focus. I love that cornfield background. Um, actually, no, that's not a cornfield. Those are just trees. It looks like a cornfield at first glance. But that's a cool photo. I like the background. I'm a big background guy when it comes to, to photos. Jenny's with us. What's up, Jenny? Johnny Boy Cards. Good morning or good afternoon. I guess it's getting close to afternoon. First Bowman, Robert Dominguez. And a couple of first Bowman Chromes, Jose Pastrano of the uh, Cleveland Guardians. It's going to take me a while to get used to saying that. Red Sox first chrome is Eduardo Lopez. But at least Guardians sounds kind of like Indians. We've got, uh, what, three more packs to go. J.D. Martinez. Francisco Lindor. Uh, Jenny says, hit any auto relics or colors yet? No. Um, no relics in this product. Autos are going to be really hard. I, I, uh, I was going over the, the odds, the retail odds on this. Uh, I think in a refractor 
is one in every 20 blaster boxes. So, uh, which tells me they printed a ton of Bowman this year, which they usually do print a lot, but it seems like, and I don't have a box handy. And I think the only boxes I have sealed still from last year are the mega boxes, but it just seems like that's super high, uh, super long odds. Here's a first Chrome Milwaukee Brewers, Brian Jaraba or uh, Brandlin, Brandlin Jaraba and uh, Brett Beatty. So with those odds, it's kind of like, ooh, $32. It's, yeah, it might be steep. I was, I was talking all about, hey, 32 bucks is still a good bang for your buck. Now it is compared to hobby. The hobby box prices are outrageous. 400 to 450 dollars uh, for a hobby box of Bowman and you get one chrome auto and it could be a pitcher auto that's 20 dollars, 10 dollars. That's a cool card, O'Neill Cruz rookie out of the Pirates. Ronald Acuña, which by the way, I think he returns tonight. Is that correct? Ronald Acuña back in the lineup for the Atlanta Braves. Giancarlo Stanton Got another top. Ooh, I think I've got some color coming up at the bottom. Henry Davis, top 100 prospect. It's unique. What I've noticed about these blaster boxes here in 2022 is that the chrome are at the bottom of the pack. Where in in past years, uh, in past years, the chrome cards have been right smack dab in the middle. There's a green something at the bottom of this. You might be able to see that green. See that green? All right, so we've got uh, Zayed Salinas with some green poking out. Let's see. What do we have? It's a first green refractor numbered to 99. And it is Ricardo Genovese. Numbered to 99. So we're going to have to sleeve him up right quick. Don't leave it. you got to sleeve it. Ricardo Genovese, San Francisco Giants. Numbered to 99, Green Refractor. He was born in 1999, so he's a little older uh, prospect-wise for, for Bowman, I, I should say. Uh, his birthday is actually coming up in two weeks, so he'll be 23. So he is actually, he's kind of old for, uh, for a prospect. Uh, so first Bowman Chrome Green Refractor, uh, Ricardo Genovese of the San Francisco Giants. That's the first. That's the first hit. All right. Last pack of the second blaster. I think I'll do three blasters on this video. Uh, and then I've got to do some, uh, run some errands. And, uh, and then uh, I'll do probably another, maybe another three blaster break this afternoon. And uh, maybe some more tonight. We'll see. Anthony Rizzo still hurts to see him in a New York, New York Yankees uni. Manny Machado. Got Hoy Park. He started out as a, a Yankees prospect. Let's see, uh, Eduardo Lo, another Eduardo Lopez, Yoelki Cespedes, Diego Cartaya, Dodgers. Got a first Chrome, uh, Ian Lewis of the Marlins, and a uh, prospect for the Oakland A's, Tyler Soderstrom. All right, so two blasters in. We did pull a, a green refractor. Of uh, Ricardo Genovese, Genovas, green to 99. All right. Where did my trash go? Jenny says, I'm just loading my twins cards into TCDB. Very cool. I'll have to, uh, I'll tweet out the odds. Uh, I'll tweet out the uh the odds here after I end this video. So this will be the last blaster on this video, and I'll, I'll go live again later this afternoon. Uh, by the way, if you're in uh, Southern, if you're in Wisconsin, even Minnesota, Illinois, Madison Card Show this Saturday, Madison, Wisconsin, Sheraton Hotel, 706 John Nolan Drive, 120 tables. It's a sold-out show, free admission, runs 9 a.m. to 3 p.m., so check that out. Here we got a high five futures of Luis Rodriguez of the Dodgers. So actually, that's why uh, after I end this, I've got to make a run over to the Sheraton just to get everything uh, prepared for Saturday's show. Brett Beatty. Oh, somebody was asking about George Valera. And here it is. A first Chrome 
of George Valera. And again, these will be available for sale in my eBay store. The link is in the description. If, uh, if you buy three or more cards, it's an automatic 15% discount at checkout. And if uh, you buy seven or more cards, it's an automatic 25% discount at checkout. And that uh, link to my eBay store is in uh, the description. 608 asks, selling the boxes at the show. I will not be, I'll be ripping all of these blasters for myself. Um, there may be, I do have a couple dealers that, that, uh, sell some retail. Um, if, if it comes in locally, they, they might sell it. So there are a couple dealers that, that may have some, uh, here's a Jason Dominguez insert Bowman in 3d. Very cool card. I like that insert set. It's new, but I also like the classic insert sets like the top 100 prospects. I really want to pull the Alexander Canario, which I'm very surprised he was, uh, included in the top 100 baseball prospects from, from this product, because he's not in any of the mainstream uh, top 10 lists for the Cubs organization. I think MLB Pipeline has Canario as the number 18 ranked prospect. And uh, Baseball America, he's not in the top 10. I'm not sure where he fell in their top 30. But uh, I, was, I was surprised that he's included number 91 in this set. And here's a Dominguez base chrome. Where's the Cubs hiding? I've pulled two so far. Uh, in, in fact, they both came in the first box. Uh, Luis Verdugo, first Chrome. And uh, Johendrick Panango. And I'm not sure the, 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 the veteran checklist, and there's only 100 veterans uh, on the checklist. So it's, uh, and I don't think the Cubs actually have anybody in the veteran checklist, which is not surprising because Rizzo, Baez, Chris Bryant, they're gone. Maybe Wilson Contreras is in the checklist, but I, I haven't pulled him yet. So I, I don't think there's any Cubs. And the Cubs don't have any uh, any rookies for this release that would be included. Here we've got a rookie of the year favorite, Jaron Duran, which I think I've pulled him already. Uh, here's a new first Bowman, Makai Backstrom of the Braves. Uh, let's see, a first of uh, Diego Rincones. Uh, let's see, Daryl Hernaez, first Bowman, and a couple of first chrome, or uh, one first chrome of Samad Taylor, and a twin of Mazel Urbina. All right, a couple more to go. Uh, by the way, again, if you're if you're new to the channel, I'm gonna break uh, a whole bunch of these. I'll probably do a few more later today. Um, I'll be breaking my buddy Her Herman's gonna be in town tomorrow. We'll go live tomorrow night breaking some stuff on this channel. And uh, and then who knows when uh, the rest of them. I'll probably, uh, I'll do some this afternoon, some tonight, uh, and then uh, the rest maybe tomorrow night. So we'll see. But uh, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already, if you're not subscribed. Hit the like button. I appreciate it. Here's a Virtuos, Virtu, Virtuosic. How the hell do you say that? Virtuosic Vibrations, Diego Cartaya. What time are you picking Herman up? So I think his plane lands at 11 a.m., so uh, around lunchtime. And then I'll give him a tour of uh, the downtown area, grab some lunch, and, uh, and then we'll play with baseball cards the rest of the day. So here we go. Pete Crow Armstrong. There's a Cub. He's been on fire lately. And the, I think he plays for Myrtle Beach or maybe uh, South Bend. I can't remember which. Uh, which team he's in single a it's one of the two but uh he he made the i think he made number three this week on baseball america's um hot prospect list and uh he had another great game uh last night or the night before hedbert perez of the brewers uh, let's see victor says is the airport far from the hotel no uh it's maybe 10 minutes 15 minutes max Pete is at Myrtle Beach. Ah, yes. Myrtle Beach. Speaking of the Cubs, a former Cub, Chris Bryant. Rich, good to see you in the chat. I've got to pull a Christian Hernandez. Uh, Myrtle Beach just watched him play last week against Del Marva. Very cool. Just hopped into the stream. Any bangers? Adam says, uh, just a green. 
uh, pulled a green number to 99 chrome first chrome Ricardo Genovese, Genovese of the Giants. Uh, let's see, Garrett Cole of the Yankees, Jose Barrera of the Cincinnati Reds. There's Herman's guy, Freddie Freeman. The wife flying into Madison tomorrow night. Cool. Oh, nice. Very cool. Yeah, it's yeah, it's a short drive. DL Hall. Luca Tresh. Never heard of him. He plays for the Kansas City Royals in, the, in their system. Samad Taylor, paper. Joshua Baez, first paper of the uh, Cardinals. Oswaldo Cabrera. Adam says, I got serious FOMO after passing on Walmart. Went to Walmart at lunch and struck out. Lloyd hit a Jordan Wicks auto in my first edition Bowman box. Very cool. Luca Tresh Chrome. Um, yeah, the uh, the airport to uh, the hotel. I'm trying to think what the, the quickest way. I, usually I don't take that route because I'm on the, the opposite end of town. I'm trying to think of what the easiest way. Probably jump on the interstate to the Beltline maybe. I'm trying to think of where where that all ends up. But yeah, it's uh, I'd say probably 15 minutes. So but I think the airport from where I'm at is 25 minutes and then from my house to the hotel is 10 minutes. Javi Baez in a Detroit Tigers uniform. Here's a first Bowman of Sadani Rafaela. Of the uh, Boston Red. I'm probably mispronouncing all of these guys. Here's Jordan Lawler. I thought was uh, so Lawler must have been in. He must have had a first Bowman in, in draft because I thought he was a first Bowman in this product, but apparently not. Or they just didn't put the first Bowman logo on, uh, which happens. Uh, Leover Peguero of the, the Pirates. It happened to him. And three boxes in, I did not pull a Christian Hernandez, which which. Is not fun. I pulled three Cubs, Pete Armstrong, Pete Crow Armstrong, and Johendrick Penango, and Luis Verdugo. So that is 2022 Bowman blaster boxes delivered from uh, from Walmart. Um, they, I know they were going in and out of stock on Tuesday night into Wednesday. Uh, so I'm glad I pounced and ordered 24 blaster boxes of. I've got 21 still to open. I'll probably do another three or four uh, later this afternoon. And uh, and then we'll do uh, do a bunch tomorrow night when Herman's in town. Lebney asks, uh, what are the cards we should be looking for? Basically, any first, any Bowman firsts, especially when it comes to Chrome. Um, a lot of the guys are, um, you know, and it's kind of even sometimes when they're not high on prospect lists, their hobby, they're hot in the hobby. So um, what I tend to do is just kind of look at uh, sold prices and, and trending prices on eBay uh, just to to get an idea of, okay, who's hot and who's who's selling for, for, for decent. So that's my first three blasters. It's noon, so I have to run some errands and I'll be back. So maybe 3 p.m. Central time. Um, Trying to think think out my day here. Maybe 3 p.m., 4 p.m. Central Time. Um, I'll do another. I've got four on my table, so I'll do another four blaster boxes later this afternoon. So join me 3 p.m. Central today. We'll do four more 2022 Bowman blaster boxes. Thanks for jumping in on the chat. I love it. Uh, hit the subscribe button if you're not subscribed. Hit the like button. Uh, have a great uh, afternoon. And uh, before I go, I'll answer Luke. Uh, how much were the blasters at Walmart newer to the channel? Uh, uh, so the, uh, the the blasters were at walmart.com $31.98, which uh, is a pretty steep increase. I still like it at that price point. But uh, $32 basically. And I think that's what it's going to be in stores as well, Target or Walmart. There may be a couple dollar difference, but expect to pay even in store 30 bucks for a blaster of 2022 Bowman. Victor says, go Cubs. Absolutely. Go Cubs. Go Bowman. And uh, join me later today about 3 p.m. Central, and uh, we'll open some more Bowman. Have a great afternoon.